rent prices in Western Province increased by 74% from 2018 to 2021. According to the annual land price index released in the Western Province except Colombo Municipality area the overall land price values have increased by 74% from 2018 to 2021. The company also revealed that, on an annual basis, the increase in average land prices between 2018 and 2021 was 15%. As a result, if an investor were to invest in property and hold it for 4 to 5 years, his initial investment would multiply largely over time. When compared with the fluctuations in interest rates for fixed deposits, these values are major contrasts proving further towards the profitability of the real estate industry in the country. Between the first quarters of 2019 to 2021, fixed deposit rates have reduced from 11.41% to 6.29%. While the land price acceleration in the western province slowed down from 22% in 2019 to 18.56% in 2021. This is especially significant given that in most countries across the world, the real estate market has experienced major downturns with the spread of COVID-19. During the last four years, a growing demand for land in the suburbs was also witnessed with price increases being reported from Kalanawa, Hanwella, Piliagoda and Wilampatia in the Colombo district. Cities such as Klanaya, Damp and Katawatha in the Gampaha district showed price increases as well, providing further evidence to the changing patterns of Sri Lankan property buyers. Among these cities, however, what topped the list in fluctuation during the four years was in Giriya and the Kalyatara district. The land prices in the city had experienced a 246% increase from 2018 to 2021. This is an annual average increase of 51% with a 109% increase between 2020 to 2021. The record of Angiria was followed by Angota that ranked second and Kalanawa, which had the third highest land price fluctuations from 2018 to 2021. The data further revealed that on an annual average basis the increase in land prices in the former between 2020 to 2021 was 69% while the latter was at 4%. Commenting on this the head of research at Lanka Property Web, Thurindu Jayarathan said, when we analyze the land price movements for the last four years, it is inevitable that the demand has driven away from district capitals to suburbs which have development agendas.